Hi Pisces, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into it, Pisces. Thank you, God, for blessing Pisces with a clear, concise message from you. So let's start with love. Let's see what's going on for you in love this week. The Three of Cups, very nice. Um, could be engaging with your partner, going to social events, socializing, getting a lot. You heard invitations or uh, well wishes, uh, making announcements, um, just being in the spotlight, maybe a... Uh, it's going really well for you. Maybe I'm, I'm seeing like date night and uh, especially with maybe Valentine's Day coming up, uh, date night and, um, you know, just really having a, a really good time, a really fun time with uh, your love partner. You could have more than one also, too. Um, you have the page of cups. So there's somebody being very romantic because this card talks about the need to be more romantic or someone being emotionally available to you. Um, it just seems as if uh, you're getting what you want. Um, there, there's also a level of emotional immaturity. Um, maybe even making an announcement. This is what you're doing with your partner this week. Let's see. What else is going on for Pisces this week? Let's see. Pisces, the death card. All right, so something is transitioning. You're making some announcement about this transition that the relationship is having. Now, this could be a good transition, like you're going from boyfriend and girlfriend to engaged. Uh, you could be going from not being parents to parents and making the announcement. The Seven of Pentacles, maybe that someone is pregnant here. The Seven of Pentacles talks about pregnancy. Um, it talks about, yeah, the um, no... Uh, mobility, not mobility, but no activity uh, for about nine months here. It just talks about uh, you guys are finishing what you start here. Maybe, um, you know, evaluating the relationship and taking it to the next level. Um, there's going to be profit here, investment here. So some of you could be making an announcement about maybe pregnancy or getting lots of well wishes about maybe you going into this new phase of life or this new way of existing now. Um, yeah, judgment here. You have to determine some of you. OK, so this is taking a turn here. Some of you have to determine if a relationship is worth you continuously investing or this is what someone is doing about you. You have to call judgment in terms of um, either forgiving and absolving of all of the shit that you both have done to each other or just maybe forgiving and moving on. The universe is asking you to do this so that they can take you to the next level, the next cycle, you know, but they need you to be on board. They need you to be firm and final. Uh, the final decision, the final judgment here. Uh, what else is going on for Pisces here? What's going on for Pisces here? Uh, the high priestess, yeah, another decision, uh, two card. All right, so it's like you you know, you, it's like you have an inner knowing of what you need to do. Uh, maybe you have some, uh, I heard prophecy of what will happen. Some of you could be um, listening to your intuition. Um, you're making a decision by way of your intuition. There could be some secret plan that you have for yourself that doesn't involve your partner. What else is going on here for Pisces in terms of love here? Pisces, okay. Uh, yeah, Empress, it's like you wanna take, you wanna be abundant and flourish and maybe even, um, some of you may even wanna get pregnant or you know, you wanna go from being in the background to being in the spotlight or having the title or being the number one. It's like maybe you're going to do this by way of pregnancy or um, yeah, you want the relationship to get out of this despondent place. It's like you know that maybe somebody is still attracted to the mother of their child or children or something about mother energy, um, secret mother energy challenge it's like um also attraction beauty fashion and attraction yeah somebody's attracted to something else or to some other way of of living life they have secret plans of maybe get, gaining their abundance back and then maybe even going solo let's see what career and finance offers uh pisces what do we have to say okay okay pisces your cards are Ten of Pentacles in the moon. So it's like, yeah, you're going to get your finances up. Um, you could be doing something again, like um, 
somebody in your family doesn't like you or there could be talks around how you make your money. You could be making money doing something that is taboo or something that is under the radar. Making some questionable deals. There could be family members who are talking about how much money you have. Maybe they want you to partner in or go in. Yeah, somebody is, you know, coming at you and trying to persuade you to take this leap of faith with them, to start this new ende endeavor development. So someone knows that you have money, but um, they may be disappointed because the answer may be no with the five of cups here, or you're trying to go to someone with this opportunity um, to make money and um, they may not be with it or they may not be as persuaded or they might not be persuaded as a, at all for some of you. You're contemplating, um, this is a job change. You would be doing it fast and it's something new, or like a, some, maybe a new company. Um, the partnership agreement is better. You may be doing this behind the scenes. You feel like it's gonna get you to a place of super abundance with the 10 of pentacles. So this is what I have for you Pisces. If it resonates for you, go over to the website book there, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also come to the live reading. I, I am live Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Come for the collective reading and come to ask a question or two. Thank you Pisces, many blessings to you.